These things ain't that tough. There's something you need to see. It's very, very important because, uh, you know, an actor knows that the imagination, you know, is, is, is the big fundamental key. Movies expose you, the camera's in your face, you're on a big screen, we can see into your eyes. So to a certain extent, you have to believe it. Um, and I think that having an actor there is, is, is what helps push the story forward. It was difficult. I mean, like you said, it was my first project. So it was a big step to just for it being my first project and then also working with green screen was pretty crazy and there were days where I'd be like, I don't know how to do this. Um, you know, they, they, you look at an orange piece of tape and they're like, it's a kaiju, ready, go, action, you know? <laughs> very important, very important. You, you're, you're rebounding off each other. You're listening to each other. You're, um, you have to be in sync with each other. So you have to get along, you have to cooperate together. Guillermo's fingerprints are all, all over both films. Um, I think, you know, as, as was apparent last night at the Oscars, there's a great amount of affection for Guillermo because we all know that his intentions and his creativity and his passion are what drive the, these, these projects. And so, you know, coming back to Pacific Rim, um, even though Guillermo wasn't directing it, he was, I believe, on, you know, Shape of Water and other projects, Stephen really took on the mantle and the tone of that and created a set which was as enjoyable to work on as the first one. Very demanding. We were all, the whole cast, which made it a little better because we were all in it together, but we were all on a strict diet and we were in the gym every single day working out, full body workouts, um, which was very foreign to me because I'd never done anything like that before. Um, but it, but it was fun because we were all in it together. Um, we were all helping each other stay on our diets and making sure we didn't cheat. So, um, yeah, it was crazy, but it was very heavily involved in it. I, could be, I, like, a, I like a good old, you know, technology, but I do like to separate from it as well. You know, I would like to leave my phone down and take a break and just enjoy nature as well. But it's a, it's a nice fine balance that I've got. Now, everything's at our disposal. Everything's digital electronic. Now, there's two sides to that. One is it's amazing, it's revolutionized the world. And the other side is that um, we, are, we are connected, so connected to our phones and our computers um, that I think we lose sometimes the human element of, um, of talking to each other, of, of communicating. Well, it's always good getting a script and, you know, turning the page and realising that you get to, one, go outside the laboratory and, two, to be involved in the solution um, uh, yeah, without, you know, any spoilers or whatever. But he's the guy, you know, who comes up with the, with the answer um, in more ways than one. So, yeah, it's exciting uh, that he gets to be a bit, of an, a bit more of an action hero in this one. <laughs>